George Davis, congratulations. Tell me, when did you first hear about your release? Half past two this afternoon. And what happened? I was called down to see the IG. The and, Assistant uh, Governor? Yeah. And uh, he said to me I was going to be released. And uh, the reason that they was going to release me would be uh, made known to the Commons by the Home Secretary at half past three this afternoon. So you still don't know the reason that you've been released from Albany Prison? No. What's your first reaction to this? Yeah, it's just unbelievable. Yeah, it, it must be a dream to be in a prison at half past two and on a train going back to London at half past five. You just can't explain the feeling. It's just <laughs> fantastic. Do you think that the campaign to get you released from prison has been instrumental in this decision? Oh yes, definitely, most definitely. What situation was the campaign in? Were, were, was pressure still being brought to get your release from Albany? At all times, yes. Did you always think that you were going to get free, or had you resigned yourself to uh, serving your full sentence in Well, I, I knew in my own mind, eventually, the truth was going to come out. One way or another. It doesn't matter, didn't matter whether I served all that sentence. One day, it was, the truth was going to come out. The eyes have sunk in properly yet, I suppose, but uh, you know, at the moment I feel nice. Right. Well, I believe it now, obviously. You now he's sitting next to me, you know. So the efforts of the last couple of years has been worth it, I think, anyway. George, as you drove through the streets of the East End and you saw all the signs, George Davis is innocent, OK, what did you feel? Well, I'm very proud, you know, of my friends and my family, you know, just that they've never never given up hope for me. And they've, it, by them not giving up, it gives me, give me hope. How much do you think you've suffered, then, as a result of this? Well, I mean, it's irreparable, isn't it? I so, uh, can you imagine? I've lost two two good years of my life. And not only that, I've, I've missed the enjoyment of my family. It just, just can't be replaced. Your wife has campaigned ceaselessly uh, for your innocence and for your for your freedom now. How do you feel about her? I, 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 I can't express my words, can I, really, for that. I mean, I'm, I'm so proud, it's unbelievable. 